Good evening and regards. My name is Dr. Anand, Pediatrics Faculty. And today is a wonderful day. Thousands of students have uh, given the FMG exam. And in front of us today, we have a very wonderful, good-hearted, wonderful nature person who has cleared the FMG exam in the first attempt. Yes. So, sir, could you please tell me your full name and where are you from? Yeah, sure, sir. Thank you for asking. I am from uh, Kerala. My name is uh, Dr. Bismon Jibu. And I'm still getting used to this uh, telling, I mean, addressing myself as uh, Dr. Bismon Jibu. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Very true, very true. So where have you done your MBBS from? I have done it from uh, Far Eastern Federal University from Russia. Okay, great. So what was the reaction of your uh, parents because uh, clearing such a tough exam in the first attempt? Mm -hmm. So what was, what was the everyone's reaction at home? Oh, the reaction actually, I don't know. It's quite crazy. Uh, like it was quite crazy because I saw the results three days after it was out. Uh, <laughs> when, yeah, we had a plan to go for a vacation uh, before the results were out. But surprisingly, like, you know, the results were out sooner. Uh, we was traveling to uh, like you know an, a vacation place, and uh, the results came out while I was uh, like you know driving, <laughs> and then <laughs> I told my parents that you know I have a vision like uh, for the past three four months, I had a thought in my head I want to when I'm seeing the results I want to see at right at this place which is my church I want to pray to God and I want to see at right at this exact spot. And I had imagined like how my reaction would be, how my parents will like, you know, react. So I really wanted things to go according like, you know, to, to, to that. So three days of vacation, it was like, you know, mixed for me personally, but uh, all the people uh, like, you know, who had come with me passed and I waited until I reached home and only the next day I saw the results and uh, it I was, uh, I could, I couldn't like, you know, be happy fully, like, because I was so shocked after seeing my results. <laughs> I, I, yeah, I, yeah. I, I was like so numb uh, for, I don't know, for uh, three, four days straight after I saw the results. But I started to tell people that, you know, I passed and when I, my parents are, uh, uh, they are settled abroad, they are in the UK. So I video called them and I asked uh, I told my mom and my like you know mom just bursted into tears and it was really happy for me to you know see that and my dad dad was also like extremely happy <laughs> very true very true so so my, my my question to you is like if 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 a, if a very new student who is watching your interview mm -hmm. and he also yeah. has dreams to you know to impress his parents and he want to do something in life so so how mm -hmm. one should deal with this what was your approach in uh, in in achieving this exam my approach, um, see, sir, I couldn't study like, you know, for the first, because <clears> my parents <throat> were there. Then I had moved to another city so that I can have a, like, you know, better environment for studying. I, so I uh, sat with my friends. I had, like, you know, I have uh, four friends with whom we, with whom uh, I took a room and we were studying, like, you know, at that time. So if you have an environment like that, you will be always motivated to study, like, even if you are down, you'll feel you'll see someone else studying, and then you will also feel like studying. And I had like you know a set of goals, like I have a diary, uh, and uh, I had written down in that uh, what I want for life. Like I, the first line of the diary was like you know uh, I have to pass, I have to clear FMG, uh, 2024 December, uh, like you know for this much mark. And I just did not just write that. I had gone through it every day. The moment I wake up, I used to go through that uh, diary. And then I was like, you know, I have to do this at this at this point of time. I have to do this stuff. And then next, I have a vision. I had a vision, like, you know, uh, because you are teaching your brain. The thing that we have to strengthen during this preparation most is our brain. Whether it is, uh, like, you know, uh, root map you're creating, whether it is meditation. I used to do meditation also, like, it really yeah. helped me. So, very true, very true. Manifestation plays a very important role. It's almost like a manifesting only something and it's happening, 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 and it automatically happens by the end. Very true. Okay, so the next question I have for you is, like, uh, what are the do's and don'ts you you you, you discovered while preparing for, <laughs> for the exam? Yeah, so the... 
डूज आई वुड से दैट यू नो वॉट एवर लाइक यू नो डाउन यू आर हैविंग इन लाइफ सी इफ see first i i i really like to say one god that goga sir have in every pdf pdf that you know he give us he all he gives us which is uh, it doesn't matter what others are doing it matters what you are doing so that is something that is very personal to me also because when you see others mark you often get you know disheartened and other mm-hmm. doses do do for me do i personally uh, like you know felt it it is much better is that you know if you have an option uh, to choose between competing between uh, with another person and also partnering with another person you always have to partner because the like you know i partnered with one of my best friend uh, who is uh, dr bharat narayanan and uh, some other friends also so since we were like you know studying with a bunch of people i was studying with a bunch of people we used to ask each other questions we used to solve each other's doubts and all so like you know um i don't know subconsciously things went in like in our head and it was much more interesting so uh, if you Very have true. an option like that choose like that mm-hmm. rather than you know being sad about what other people are you know getting yeah. marks and all the stuff and Very uh, true. and uh, mm-hmm. then i would say that you know the people who sacrifice until the last will definitely you know taste success which is something i personally like you know uh, could ex- experience because uh, me uh, i had i have i was sick approximately for 15 days uh, i was i don't know i was very disheartened and i i did not know what to do at that time and uh, my friend also he got typhoid uh, and he was on treatment even while like, you know he was uh going for the exam so seeing that i would say that you know uh if uh, somewhere something is stopping you whether it is like you know uh whatever is happening in your life <laughs> if Very something true. is happening to your parents or your friends or what don't let that stop you, you from studying and uh, very true and you know uh, accord that you also have you also have told like you know be stronger than your excuse Yeah, Which, yeah. Be stronger than your strongest excuse. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So that also came to, to my mind a lot. So very true. So one things. more thing, I want to ask you: this, like, how to avoid distraction? Because uh, lo- uh, social media is everywhere, mobile is everywhere. Yeah. Parents are not watching us all the time. Mm-hmm. So wh- how to avoid distraction, according to you? That's a very great question, sir. Uh, I personally did not use Instagram uh, like straight for six months after coming to India. I decided that I don't want to use Instagram. and youtube videos also i hardly watched down to 10 uh, videos probably uh, like you know other than academic uh, this thing academic uh, whatever content was necessary academic videos of course i watched and uh, you have to use it wisely also so that is thing uh, to avoid distractions it's quite difficult you know uh, hearing that popping i mean hearing that popping sound yeah. always leads us to like you know um, checking our phone regularly somehow so you have to avoid instagram especially and you have to use uh, youtube also wisely like rather than you know going through these shots which is completely not necessary you have to see what is like you know motivating you mm-hmm. uh, one mm-hmm. one thing i pers- like you know i used uh, uh, you know which motivated me was i used to see these videos of people who like you know have passed uh, like you know their reaction when they saw the results so whenever i felt like not studying and you know when i couldn't push myself a lot i used to watch these videos and you know it was very helping for me so it's all about like you know uh, using your like channeling your distractions into the right way very true it's like you're putting the energy in the right direction yes, slowly yes. directly or indirectly and yes, it's helping sir. you out very wonderful okay great so so the last question i have for you is any two important advice you want to give for the next generation lot of students are going to watch this interview lot of new generation mm-hmm. are coming thousands of people are coming to india and going to give this exam so yes, any sir. two important advice or suggestions which you think will be fruitful if someone watches your interview yeah sure sir first thing is uh, if fmg is the lock there is no other key other than you know consistency so you have to lock yourself honestly like you know somehow so that you have to sit and study one thing i found it 
so beneficial was cerebellum classes because uh, from 5 o'clock to 12 o'clock i had no other option other than sitting for the class and i had you know kept uh, like you know uh, aim and uh, like things that you know i definitely have to um, do the ends before it's getting over and it was very like you know be- so beneficial for me i i could understand how the teachers used to think for an answer so that is one thing and to see people you uh, say these things easily like you know uh, how uh, consistency is the key consistency is the key but a lot of people doesn't know how do you actually keep yourself consistent so i really would like to say how people can like you know keep uh, oneself consistent it's about gamifying things gamifying since things in self uh, example in uh, uh, snapchat we have streaks right so like that if hmm. you uh, you know put yourself in that level uh, for example what i had done is i had kept kept a goal like 100 questions per day and this many hours of study so whenever i sat for studying i on the timer and whenever i ke- like sat i mean whenever i got up from the seat i off the timer and at the end of mm. i will mark like you know this many hours i <clears> studied <throat> and this many questions mm. i did and i used to uh, light it in like i used to color the column in green uh, for example mm. this is thing these are every day mm. like you know whatever i did 100 okay. questions per day 180 yeah. questions so if very it is good, very uh, good mm. yeah if if i'm able to reach my target then i will color it in green so i had this addiction mm. I, which i had created like you know i have to complete this mm-hmm. the next day also so if you can mm-hmm. you know you know gamify stuff first advice which is like you know uh, you you no, no no one and nothing can stop you from passing fmg and second advice is mm. that you know uh, you have to appreciate yourself one thing i used to do like you know whenever i got an answer right or uh, whenever you know in te- like teachers whenever they used to ask question and if i knew the answer then i used to just tap on my back so that also like you know created a push for me okay i knew i know some stuff and uh, not everyone knows everything we have to selectively mm-hmm. study like you know that but you know 100 times or uh, whatever yeah. how much have you, how many times have you can study uh, like you know you have to uh, be focused on that and uh, not have this form of, of missing out like you know a lot mm. of stuff so until last you have to very true very true yeah. i mean hard work versus smart work everyone is working hard but smart yes, approach sir. smart work plays a very important role where you don't stress out your brains also and you are able to filter things out i think very yes, wonderful sir. points you have to told i think it will going to be very beneficial for the students who is watching this interview so great great i think i i wish you all the beautiful things in life and i really want that you should you know clear more exams and give lot of interviews yeah. to us yeah sure thank so, you sir thank, thank, you. thank you thank you so much for giving me your time yes please take care yeah thank you thank you sir thank you so great the interview is over bro uh, please take it over self and i think it's all done all dusted and uh, yeah. let's be in touch that's it okay yeah personally thank you so much sir like i'm i don't yeah. say this usually but i'm a great fan of yours because <laughs> uh, you know yeah, I, i used to see your whatsapp status and i used to be like you know i i was uh, having wonders in my head like i used to think how can a person uh, schedule themselves for so many things like you used to go for mm-hmm. uh, like, you know dancing and you used to go for go to the yeah. gym badminton <laughs> and uh, i seriously have no words for that and no, you know it's very easy yeah and uh, one thing pediatrics was actually like you know one of my most favorite subject and some subjects when we hear for the first time uh, we used to have this anxiety okay first time i'm hearing this but the way you thought like you know everything whatever you thought you told the second time if you're telling uh, this is the thing then again you told you told the same thing so 
that reduce the anxiety a lot actually <laughs> mm, very true no no you you have worked hard a lot brother you have worked so well and that is why your result is shining i think it's a, it's a it's a both way you know input my input also and yours input also but keep working hard yes, in life like this keep keep achieving your dreams and keep uh, uh, participating in extra curricular activities because physical fitness plays a very important role because it will release yes, endorphins sir. and automatically you start manifesting oh my god everything is possible i can do anything oh my god i'm looking so good automatically the positive vibes come um, so that's the whole yeah, story yeah true sir yeah true sir <laughs> so take care of <laughs> yourself see you around yeah, yeah.